stood on the stage looking out at the death of a bright summer. And small clusters of people were sitting on the grass under some pissed off looking clouds, umbrellas at the ready. And children in excessive performance makeup were flitting around backstage like exuberant flies on a massive, massive piece of shit. It was never supposed to be like this. Every moment of my adult life had been spent striving for something that was now dying amidst the miserable, hysterical enthusiasm of a local radio roadshow. All my dreams had come true and it was unthinkably depressing. And the weather was ugly, and the turnout was dismal, and the day was a complete fucking disaster. That much was obvious. Still, the MC was bravely doing her thing with a forced joy that made her appear psychotic. All right, how you doing? Make some noise! She shrieked. And no noise was forthcoming. <laughs> Radio Nowheresville had wanted a celebrity turn, but they could only afford Easy World. <laughs> We were warming up the tiny crowd for a local primary school dance troupe. It was an all-time low. There could be no coming back from this. The backing track started, and like a trio of obedient performing chimpanzees, we began miming an approximation of live music. There was none of that familiar old stage adrenaline, just an overwhelming sense of shame. And then the rain started, right on cue. If there is a god, he really knows when to put the boot in. Kids slid off the bouncy castle and put their shoes on and ran for shelter. A tarp was thrown over the toffee apple stand, and the 15 or so people who had been watching with disinterest were now heading for the trees. The audience was gone. I didn't care. I wasn't even singing, just moving my mouth. It wasn't even a real gig. Hell, it wasn't even a real microphone. This was a fitting end. Just me and two people who hated my guts, pretending to play music to an empty field. If there was any comfort to be derived from this final humiliation, I could at least appreciate the irony that I was having a bloody awful time miming to a song about what a bloody awful time I was having. <laughs> but that's just me, sincere to the last. And the other crumb of solace was I, I knew that this was as bad as it could possibly get. There were no more mistakes left to be made. I had a complete set. And it turns out I was wrong about that as well. Oh, but it wasn't over for me. I knew that much. There was still a bright future to be had making music. All I needed to do was just get the hell out of the music business.
took a long cold walk in the rain I only want to feel something again Give 